All right, welcome to step four of our head measurement. On your sheet, you'll see right here, we're doing measure across the head, front to back, and mark. And so we're gonna start on the left side of the head here. We're gonna start with FP1, and we're gonna go across the top of the head all the way back to 01. And we're gonna try to come through um, our C3 area here. So we're gonna come up here. And this is kind of hard on a real head because heads um, bend so much and you're trying to keep your tape measure straight. So, um, like I said, it's really hard. I'm getting 24. So I'm gonna take half of 24, which is 12, and I'm gonna mark, which is right here, okay? So I'm just gonna connect these two lines here, right here. And this is now where I'm gonna put my C3 electrode. Now, before I go anywhere else, we're, we need to get a hash mark right here for our um, F3 electrode. So again, I'm gonna go from FP1, and this time I'm gonna go to my C3, and I'm gonna use that point. And you always have to double check. Sometimes I think I have it lined up, and then I've moved my um, tape measure down here. So. I'm getting 12, so half of 12 is going to be 6. So right here, I'm going to make a nice hash mark. When I, ha when I finish measuring, this will be where another electrode will go. Okay, now we're going to go over to the right side, do the same thing over there. I'm going to go from FP2 right through this area to my O2. And I've moved it again. Okay, here my measurement's a little off because I'm getting 25 over here, but I'm going to go with it. I'm going to take half of 25, which would be 12.5. Again, you always mark on the same side of your tape measure, and so I'm just going to join these two pieces here. Okay, now we're going to go from our FP2 to our C, this is our C4, this is where our C4 electrode will go to my C4, and since my other measurement was a little long, this one's gonna be a little long too. So I'm getting like 13. I'm just gonna go with it though. So half of 13 is six and a half. So I'm gonna mark it. Which, although my numbers seem off, look at my line across here, looks pretty darn straight. So I must be doing something right. Okay, so um, that's the end of that step. What we did is we finalized our C3 electrode site and our C4 electrode site and then we created hash marks for um, our last two electrodes here which is our F3 and F4. So this concludes step four of our head measurement video.